Well, hello everyone. I'm Tim and this is ESL Toy Box. And today I am submitting a PowerPoint to a contest by One Skill. And One Skill helped me a lot when I was beginning to learn more about PowerPoint. And he's running a challenge right now. And in the challenge, you can submit a PowerPoint. So it all has to be on one slide. And this is what it looks like. And there we go. Now, this is a little bit more advanced, but I wanted to show one of the things and how I did it. So it might be a little bit difficult if you're just starting out. So I wouldn't suggest starting with this, but I wanted to explain it anyways. So what I want to show is the animation where it comes zooming in and then flying out that way in different bars. But to start this, we're actually going to insert a person. So let's cut out people in here and we're going to just use her. And let's make the background a little different. Okay. So first, here she is. We're going to use print screen to capture this. And we can get rid of her. Now for the, we go to the background picture texture fill and we can insert from clipboard because we use print screen, it'll show up like that. So there it is. But it's all part of the background so we can't interact with her anymore. Then we're going to insert some rectangles and I'm just gonna go outline. So now uh, we're going to animate these by having them fly in and I'm going to make it look a little bit smoother. So in effects options, smooth and flying in like that and with previous and we can copy it to each one using the animated animation painter. Okay, and now we're going to alternate each one. So these are all coming in from the left, which is all together. It's not going to look very good. So we want it to come in from the right. And then this one should come in from the right. Okay, and now we're going to slightly adjust each one's timing. So it'll come in takes a little bit longer, comes a little bit later. Just make it kind of random. Okay. Now when we play it, I'll kind of come zooming in like that. The last step, <clears throat> we're going to highlight these and in the format shape, we're going to fill it and we're going to use slide background fill and this will make it match what's behind. Now it's going to look uh, a little bit weird. She's kind of getting all pieced together. We're going to put one last thing, a rectangle that fills up the entire screen with the same color we use for the background. We'll send that to the back now it makes uh, a sheet of this green color between the background and our animation. So when we play it, it'll come zooming in like that. You can repeat it to have exit animations. So I put other bars in this direction and had it animated so that it would fly off the screen, but it is basically the same thing. So I hope you enjoyed that. I'll see you soon. Bye.